It's one that's set up for Huddleston. Oh, and it's ended up in the back of the net. James Chester got the touch. Well, it wasn't quite the route that they anticipated, but it's given Hull City the underdogs. What could turn out to be a famous first goal. Wow, what a start. Well, what a start for Hull. I mean, again, you can see Arsenal mainly markings only, and they've just completely left space on the edge of the box for the shots to come in. But I think Chester does remarkably well, because this comes at him so quickly, and all he does is redirect it, because the pace is already on it, and he just has to steer it, and it's out of Fabianski's reach. There's nothing the goalkeeper can do about that, and Arsenal just got caught cold and didn't defend it well. That's Myler going for it. The set piece threatens to undo Arsenal again. Quinn, good play from him. And it's nearly two, and it is! It's Curtis Davis this time. The defenders are doing the job, and Arsenal have got no defence against them. This is the FA Cup, you better believe it. Arsenal have been flat-footed and asleep at the back. Myler almost beats Sanya, but doesn't Quinn do extremely well to get it back in? Fabianski does very well too to deal with Bruce's effort, and it just falls perfectly. The first one reacting is the skipper, Curtis Davis. It took a little deflection, the header as well, and uncut the upright. It wasn't Fabianski, but. He can do nothing about the follow-up again because Davis is just perfectly positioned and this is just a nightmare start. It brings back memories of Stamford Bridge and Anfield this season. So, it is the little Spaniard, Santi Cazola! <laughs> Arsenal one, Hull two. A classic free kick. And we're heading for a classic FA Cup final. Nothing McGregor could do about it. Well, I wonder, I wonder with the goalkeeper because he set his wall up to guard the right post and essentially he's got to look after the other side. Now, he's on that side and he should be dealing with it. The problem for him, and you see it so often, Martin, is he takes a step to his right. But even having done that, I still think he should have got a little bit more on this and helped it on its way. It's a poor leap from him. And even though it is a good free kick and well placed from Cazorla, I think Alan McGregor has helped his cause. Cazorla's corner. And it's turned in from very close range by Laurent Koscielny. He's the one the Arsenal players jump on. It's another defender. And Arsene Wenger's team have come back from 2-0 down at Wembley. Well, incredible as well that it's come from yet another set piece, and again, I think the damage was done once Hull failed to win the first one. And Koscielny is fortunate in the fact that the ricochet fell really kindly for him. Hull are by now all looking at the ball, it comes off another Hull player to fall from, and all he's got to do is swivel, and even then I'm not sure the contact was great. It doesn't matter, he got something on it to get it to cross that line. And it's been improving from Arsenal since they made the change. And they're right back in it now. Oh, it was a mistake. Rossini into Davis. Ramsey crosses. Oh, and it's off the bar. A trademark header. And this was uh, Giroud. Got in front of McShane and battered it off the bar. No foul. It's uh, an intentional move, I think, Lee Probert thought. And asked to win it back. And they've got plenty of players forward here. Wilshere. Here's Giroud. Oh, brilliantly taken. Absolutely brilliantly taken by Aaron Ramsey. He's got one right. Arsenal finally lead.
side, deep into extra time. It looks as though, in the end, it's going Arsene Wenger's way. And it was a typical Arsenal goal. But for so much of the game, he's had to bide his time, he's had to wait, and he's not made the adventurers running forward that we've seen so often from him this season. But he's been given much more freedom as the game has progressed. And just look at the little dart he made into the box, and the lovely little flick back as well by Giroud to find him. And that is just a peach of a strike. Arsenal have their hands on a trophy again. They are winners of the 2014 FA Cup, even without the lid.